What is an emulsifier, really? Well, it's nice to know this, as you find emulsifiers in many of the foods we eat, such as bread, biscuits, cakes, margarine, mayonnaise, dressing, and ice cream. Well, let's first look at the word itself, emulsifier. An emulsifying agent is something that is capable of creating an emulsion. And making an emulsion means to mix two liquids that are not themselves capable of binding to each other. You might recognize the expression, to pour oil upon the waters. And you've probably noticed that oil and vinegar won't mix together at all when you make a dressing. But when you stir, you emulsify to mix the two liquids, or rather, to create an emulsion. However, it's on borrowed time, because before long, they will go their separate ways again. This is where the emulsifier comes in. An emulsifier is an ingredient that ensures that water and oil can be mixed together so that the fluids remain evenly distributed in each other. More technically, emulsifiers consist of molecules of a water-loving nature and a fat-loving nature. In this way, the emulsifier acts as a binding agent between the fat and water, in that the molecule will bind both together. But where do we really see an emulsifier being used? Well, for example, in margarine, which is a mixture of fat and water. Without an emulsifier, the water would lie on the outside of the fat. Yuck! And that's not exactly what we want from a margarine. The same is true of ice cream. Here, we can thank emulsifiers for the fact that you can make low-fat ice cream, which tastes great and is nice and creamy to eat. Mm. Without emulsifiers, the small air bubbles would disappear and the ice cream would shrink and probably not be particularly nice. And in bread, emulsifiers improve the bread's freshness. Nice and clever. However, can emulsifiers be harmful, you may ask? And the answer is no. Emulsifiers come from nature's own plants and consist primarily of vegetable oil from rapeseed, palm, sunflower, and soya beans. Moreover, an emulsifier is an ingredient that has been tested and approved. It has therefore been assigned an E number, which means it is safe to use in food products. Emulsifiers do not add any strange substances to food, but add a function or ability, namely that insoluble liquids bind together. Well, what about, uh, and no. You should not be nervous that you will swell up because emulsifiers, quite to the contrary, can help reduce the fat content of a number of foods, such as in low-fat margarine, where fat has been replaced by water. But are emulsifiers really necessary ingredients? Yes, actually they are, if we want the useful properties that emulsifiers can contribute to the foods we buy today. And that's not so bad.